Hi, I'm Molly Shannon. This is your Como Quick Cast. The search is on for two suspects after a violent crime spree along I-5 overnight. Investigators say the two were involved in six robberies at stores from Lacey up to Tukwila. At least two convenience store clerks were pistol whipped during the robberies. There were only vague descriptions of the suspects. One believed to be a black man who was wearing a mask. The other, a white man with a beard. They might have been driving a late 1990s Jeep Grand Cherokee. Check out this video out of Texas. A man grabbed his cell phone and took video of a minivan driving through his neighborhood with three children on the roof. There appeared to be two adults inside the van and the family looked to be checking out Christmas lights in the neighborhood. Police say several laws were broken, but unless someone identifies that driver, it would be a tough case to pursue. And a Nebraska police sergeant jumped into action, likely saving the life of a truck driver. The semi-truck was driving erratically when the sergeant jumped onto the moving truck and stopped it. The truck driver was diabetic and had passed out after his blood sugar dropped too low. He's expected to be just fine. I'm Molly Shen, and that was your Como Quickcast. Hi there, I'm Eric Johnson. This is your Como QuickCast. Road work could cause some problems for people driving over Lake Washington this weekend. Tonight at 11 o'clock, eastbound I-90 will be down to just one lane. Then drivers will be transferred to the express lanes between Seattle and Bellevue. On Sunday, the westbound lanes of 520 will shut down for work on the 24th Avenue Bridge. Police arrested a student at Federal Way High School this afternoon for having a gun on campus. A tip from a classmate led police to the 17 year old who was arrested without incident. The student was automatically expelled for having a gun at school. Seattle police say they will turn over every stone until they find a missing firefighter. Joshua Milton was reported missing after he failed to show for his shift last night as a student paramedic at Harborview. Milton was last seen driving his white four-door Honda Accord model year 2000. Call 911 if you have any information that might help. I'm Eric Johnson. That was your Como Quick Cast. We'll see you later.